Hey YouTube love, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is doing well. So today is going to be a combination of a tray styling video and also a coffee table styling video. A collaboration that I did on my Instagram a couple weeks back with some of my YouTube and Instagram families. So I just wanted to implement that into this video to not make this video so, so long and let you guys enjoy instead of hearing me talk. I'm going to be pointing out a few things of form just like this one and a couple of things are like from me years back so whatever I can find will be listed down below. my Instagram challenge we had two coffee table style we had to do so this was my gold version and I had a silver version so these two candle holders that I did see right there are actually from home good it was part of my last recent purchase and also this gorgeous mirror vase it's from no way is an international purchase I found the shop for my Instagram account but I'll definitely link them down below I used PayPal so it was a safe and easy transaction and the customer service is outstanding I order from them like several times. I saw the city passing by my window. Was in the crowd, but I felt so alone. Looked at my phone like every other second. My future was blurry and numb A tunnel where there's no light Oh, but then you came And sat right next to me Your eyes, they glowed And filled me up We had never met Before that time But I just knew That we'd end up You took it, you, you took it Took away
So when it comes to my coffee table styling, I love using anything that I think is pretty and goes with the aesthetic of my home. For an example, when I go shopping, I typically step out of the box, something as a champagne bucket that we all use uh, for entertainment, but who would think that this was a champagne bucket? I absolutely love finding unique shiny pieces that's kind of glam at the same time serve for like multi-purpose so this serve as a vase for the time being but when i'm entertaining it does what it's supposed to do Another thing I wanted to show you guys that I love shopping my home and sometimes it's all about tweaking just one or two things. For an example, this setup was kind of like the same one you saw from my collaboration that I did with Instagram. But what I did, I removed the Chanel book and I put this vintage coffee book in the center and I added um, new my same flowers into a champagne bucket so it kind of give it like a new vibe but still at the same time just like using the same pieces without feeling overwhelmed so like that just a simple way that i can refresh my space without going to like crazy crazy but some days like the creative side of me just going to hunt for things around my My rule of thumb when I'm adding decor piece to my coffee table, whether it's a simple thing as a tray styling, just like this one, I just have one tray, everything in the tray, and it still made a statement, but what I do in that particular moment, I make sure I spread gold all over like a buckle of gold all over the place and I also use things that's not meant to be used for a coffee table for example this marble that look like a vase is actually a utensil holder that I got from Tajay I have this now for about two years so if I can find it I'll link it down below but it's something simple that you can find at home good again I put my favorite flowers tulip that I got from Amazon if you didn't watch my Amazon's favorite it's definitely part of that list but just a combination of tulips and again changing the vase and keeping the same tray but it just like kind of give me a different vibe Another thing I do, I like using smaller vases to hold sometimes my candle holders. For an example, this gold vase is actually from Home I said Home Good, Amazon. I absolutely love it. Um, if you guys know I am in like catering and stuff like that, so I get exposed to like different um style of vases and things like that. So sometimes I get the hookup from like the vendors. Um, they let me know where I can find them. So you can definitely check Amazon for little trinkets and knickknacks like that. Now this one is actually a vase from Pottery Bone that I just added my candle from um, Bath and Body Work um, just so it gives a little extra touch to my coffee table. Switching things up, I added this beautiful tray from Home Good. It gives like a pop of black and navy, like up close you would think it's black, but up far it looks kind of navy and I love the little touch of gold um i think it's like so so pretty and again i use that same marble utensil holder and i added a permanent flower arrangement that i got from home good that i used in several videos i have that for over years now in the coaster or from marshall's so i'm going to be switching over to this marble tray this one came from wayfair and just to give my coffee table a cleaner look and so simple and so pretty So let me know down below, do you have a preference when it comes to a, an arrangement, flower arrangement that you have in your home that you made yourself or you bought from the store that you take from room to room. For me, definitely this one. The marble look is so simple. I can take it from my bedroom, my kitchen. It's just very elegant and very clean. Also having a handful of different flowers is definitely a must for me and I am a neutral girl but I love a pop of dusty rose. I think it's a beautiful color that you can use for spring, summer, 
even fall and I got this one from Michaels I love it I got it last year during the fall season and it's just like the perfect touch of color for me I think it's so pretty and so elegant what do you think Creating a beautiful vignette is something that you can definitely display anywhere in your home, from your coffee table, from your kitchen, kitchen island, bathroom. Um, definitely create a spa-like um, space in your home that you don't really have to spend that much money on. This beautiful gold vase is from Ballers and Design and also this agate coaster tray is kind of like between a coaster and a tray it's a very weird shape but I use it for everything um, I got it from anthropology like about four years ago so everything that you see in my home is like years of collecting but I love love interior design and I love making my space very unique and spa like to my family and myself so I hope you get some form of idea in this video and you got inspired some way shape and form let me know down below which area in your home that you love to style i love to hear that and i'll see you guys in my next video